Hey guys, welcome back to Target Developers. So guys, today's learning what is filter method and second how to write simple JSON file in Angular guys. So it's time to start. So let's start guys. Let the filter method returns the matched values in an array from the collection guys. It will check all the values in the collection and return the matched value in the array guys. So it will iterate through all the collection of the array json array guys and it will match every value which we give the condition guys uh, so come to our visual studio code so in this i made the filter operation for friends guys so you can see that there's csv file and html and a ts file so we'll work in the ts file first guys inside the ng on init function we will make uh, uh, json object array of json object so let's type guys array of json object we will create first array of json objects uh, we will take const here const in small Developers. We will take area inside we will add objects. First object we will give ID. We will name show. Gender. Like this, we will create a JSON objects. So first object we will create it. We will create it. Second object we will. Okay. So we have created uh, four objects. Now you can see that in both ID and uh, in second ID, the name is same Sunny and Sunny and gender is male. So we will compare this property guys here name and, and name Sunny. So we will put uh, out uh, objects this is an array collection uh, whose name is Sunny. Uh, now come to the we have created this JSON object so we will now this now we will create uh, one method here so we will comment it part we will filter an array of JSON objects So we will call we have named this collection JSON collection uh, developers. So we will put here developers dot filter. You can see that the find and filter method will put and inside this filter method we will take object guys like this get object with the arrow function guys with the arrow function we will open curly braces here and inside the curly braces we will return something Uh, obj dot name we will compare it the name property and guys equal to equal to sunny whose name is sunny so we get the collection whose name is sunny we will put sunny here <laughs> and these developers dot filter will be uh, stored on the filter let take let filter we will take anything 
and we will console this vector after that this so log sorry log okay wait so guys now we will format the document we we'll save the document with the files now we can see the output guys so expected output guys here we will see that we will get the collection of two objects guys first is this id2 and second id4 so guys you can see that output here we will expect it like this only uh, we are getting two objects 0 and 1 and uh, we are getting id2 and 4 Sunny in center B. So we have uh, two objects like two percent zero and one. So expected results came, guys. If we use here, if we copy this light filter, copy and create it, guys. If we use here some manipulation, if we use here, if we use not equal to sun. It means that whose value, whose name property is not sunny, it will print that collection. So expected output, guys, it will print ID one and ID three guys. So let's save the file. See the output. So we are expecting this only guys, Shiva and Alexa. So in this video we have learned that how filter method works with equal to and not equal to. So uh, filter method iterate uh, trace all the objects one by one and it match the property uh, given in this condition guys. It will Go to one by one object at last when the collection got completed. It will find it will store that object in our object. So it will print at last what we are getting here. So this is all about what is filter method. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, please subscribe, share, and like the button. So we will meet in the next video, guys. Thank you.